Howdy folks, it's Lee from the Hillbilly Hilton. So, this is where I'm at today. Got the heaters pulled out, because this was a South Dakota bus. So there were two auxiliary heaters and a heater pump. So, there's two hoses that come out down there. One drill long, one short. Well, the short one was the, basically the out from right there to the heater pump. And there was a chunk of hose from that heater, from the heater pump to the first heater, from that heater to the second heater, and then the long hose that I have right now to deal with is the return line that goes back to the block. So I've got them stretched out down into a metal five-gallon bucket from work used to hold stain and stuff or lacquer thinner or something I don't know what do we got today so we got some water white varnish from Sherwin Williams so that's from work so as you see yeah was one long hose and a short hose it barely reaches well I'm gonna solve that problem and clip the long hose and to the same length as that one let it finish draining then I'll clip it up there and I have only one elbow right now but this hose isn't going anywhere and I will connect that to both ends of the hose and that way come Friday on Kathy's last day of school, our oldest daughter, well, our only daughter, but our oldest, um, she gets out of school. We're going to pick her up in the bus. So, uh, see if I can pause this long enough to hold on to finish this up. All right, well, I was able to at least get it cut. So, doesn't have to be exact right now and yes I am not using the correct tool I'm using actual cable cutters see if it'll made in Germany but they're good they work so now that I've got it nipped off up here, I'll nip my two lines, put my connector in, top off the fluid, and should be good to go for our short little trip on Friday. Go. Alright. Can y'all see this? So, I got one piece done and trimmed. And I'm just going to take this other one. Did make a little bit of a mess, but it's to be expected. You're not going to get out of it scot free without making a mess. somewhat where I need it to be. And if you're curious as to why I only have one, it's because that's all the store had. And I'd been all over town looking. Then finish draining. Move the paper towels. Boom. Now, since there is going to be 
a bench seat right there in storage, we may be able to get away with just leaving it like that. Maybe. We'll see. Because it's not kinked right now, so we might be able to get away with it. So, well, that was part of our adventure for today, folks. Y'all have a good night.